there we are. John Morant running circles around the Houston defense, splitting two defenders there. If you give it a second, we'll see it again. There he is, half court fast break and splitting two defenders there. That's the jaw dropper of tonight. All right, now welcome to the 901, everyone. It's a Memphis against Houston kind of day. Here at home, we got the better of them. On the road, not so much. I only have 91 seconds to catch you up on an exciting day of sports here in the 901, so try and keep up. A day after becoming the second seed in the West, the Grizzlies allowed the Rockets to end a 12-game skid on them. The Grizzlies were out in front for majority of the first half, but the Rockets found a way to get back on track in the third while the Grizzlies slowly derailed. An unusual night for many of the Grizzlies, but Desmond Bain found his groove leading Memphis with 28 on the night. The Grizzlies fall 123-112. Now tonight just might have been the last night for Alo to play in front of a sold out Memphis crowd and what a way to go out if he chooses not to take advantage of his COVID year. Why? Well, that's because it feels so good to be back. Well, we haven't made it in Selection Sunday just yet, but looks like the Tigers are in the tourney. A clean sweep of the Houston Cougars this season for the Tigers just might have done the deed. After a year of ups and downs, the Tigers have pretty much punched their ticket to the tourney after a seven year drought and the first time since Penny Hardaway accepted the coaching position at Memphis. As of today, Memphis has moved up from the first four in to the last four buys. Although still on the bubble, they're much higher than they were just yesterday as they head into the AAC tournament as the number three seed. And on the women's side, Memphis is set to take on ECU at 3 p.m. in Fort Worth. There we go at Fort Worth, Texas tomorrow. Now this is the AAC tournament and remember a winning the conference tournament guarantees a spot in the NCAA tournament. That's about all the time I have tonight. Do you want to weigh on anything I talked about? Well, hit me up on Twitter. My handle is EWilsonTV. For now, that's all we have on tonight's 901. I'm going to toss it back to you, Yvonne. Aaron, thank you.